Let us understand some scientific facts about Indian cow breeds now. Milk is grouped as A1 and A2. Most of the cows belonging to exotic Bos Taurus group and their crossbreeds produce A1 milk due to their damaged DNA. It has a chemical substance called beta casomorphin 7 or BCM7 which separates out during digestion of this milk. This leads to autism and diabetes 1 in children. In adults, BCM7 is associated with Alzheimer, cancer, diabetes, heart trouble, etc. These are the findings of researchers in New Zealand. Indian and African cows belonging to Bos Indicus group produce A2 milk. This milk without BCM7 is safe for human consumption. Ghee from indigenous cows has healthy cholesterol. Ayurvedic medicines for heart diseases are invariably made from cow ghee. This ghee helps for brain development, improving memory and IQ. In another research, Indian cow urine has increased the count of macrophages in the blood to the extent of 104%. In comparison, Jersey urine affected for 8 to 12%. Buffalo urine for 20 to 28 percent and goat urine 40 percent increase. This indicates that Indian cow urine is helpful to develop disease resistance. Indian cow urine is a bioenhancer which decreases the dosage of other drugs. It controls the aging process. Cow urine purifies our body system and removes obstacles. It controls and destroys free radical cells, repairs damaged DNA, strengthens lymphocytes which helps to fight cancer. Cow urine has antibiotic properties also. These are all the results of researchers on Indian cow breeds in various institutes across India. Hence cow products are widely used in Indian systems of medicine. The story will be incomplete if we do not discuss the problem part of Indian cow breeds. The efficient milk breeds like Gir, Sindhi, Sahiwal, Rati etc. are at the verge of extinction. Most of the other breeds produce very less milk. This is the main reason for their unpopularity. One or two liters of milk per day will not work out for any farmer now. Dairying is providing livelihood for millions of farm families in India. We cannot neglect this fact. Most of the dairy farmers have gone for HF and Jersey cows due to unavailability of good milking cows of Indian breed. Rati Breed Research Station has developed Rati cows with 14 to 16 liters of milk per day. We find Gir, Sindhi and Sahiwal cows with more than 15 liters of milk per day here and there. If these Indian breeds with high milk yield are made available, our farmers will definitely accept them for dairying. Many of the Indian breeds have aggressive nature. Threatening the man, fighting each other, etc. are very common. Normally, the cow will not let the milk down if the calf is not fed on the udder. Milking is difficult if the calf dies. Tying one leg is a common practice to escape kicking while milking. Indian breeds expect more freedom. They are not happy with stall feeding. Grazing them is a problem now due to shortage of grazing land and people to look after them. Few breeds have the habit of jumping the fence. See, this cow is tied with a wooden piece to check its speed of running and jumping the fence. However, the wood will not harm the animal in any way. The sharp horns of these animals are the threat for us always. All these characteristics 
might have developed for their defense while grazing in the forest. Probably, there is no solution for these genetically developed habits. These are the main reasons for unpopularity of Indian cow braids.